Hello, welcome back. The purpose of this video is to show you how the unequal T pattern worked. This is the one we made here. It's D60 into 80. So on the outside here we have the stabber and on the inside here we have the contour of the hole. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with the body. So we're going to do the body in full and what we need to do is just draw, scratch in this centre line of 251.33 so that's 200 that's 5133 is about there and we go 80mm either side of that because our pipe's 80mm so we would want it to be twice as wide as the pipe Draw a line through, eighteen on that side as well, <coughs> and the same at this end. Just draw. So what we do is you take the pattern, obviously so you'd have this on a sheet of metal, and you set the line here, line it up with this one, put it to the edge like that, and then just follow the contour of the hole. Like that. And then on the other side, exactly the same thing, take it to the edge of the sheet. And then this time just add on the lap. For this exercise we've just done it at the uh, 10mm or 1cm. But you can make that as big as you want. And then just round the contour of the hole. So that is our body in full. I've done it this way so you can see that we've added on the lap. Normally I just write in the corner here and do it in two halves but we're doing this one in full. And then all that's left to do is our uh, T pieces, so the stab of itself. So what, what we do there is we draw around the pattern, like that. Now if we are going to put a machined edge on it, so you're putting it through your rear uh, swager, you just leave it like that and then just turn that edge over in your swager. And if you're going to put a feathered edge on, you just offer that up again like that and just add on a little bit like a flap like that to feather it. So that that's T piece with lap and then the one without lap, which is still underneath here. Obviously, you, you do these on a piece of sheet metal to the size that you required. So we draw in a 
like that. Just draw these down. And the same again. If you wanted it without a feathered edge on your machined edge, you just machine that edge there, put it through your swager, and if you want a feathered edge, you just add that bit on again, like that. And feather this. So all that's left to do now would be to cut them out, put them through the slip roller and put them together and when you do you'll have the perfect unequal tea like this one I made before to show you the, in the demonstration. So thank you very much for watching my demonstration please subscribe, share and like. Thank you very much until next time goodbye.